Hello everyone, uh, this is D Infinity X. Welcome back to another episode of Space Engineers where I am going to work on the barn here just a little bit for so that uh, when we do our next stream we're not uh, it's not so uh, difficult and we have some things to do and I, I mostly want to get this uh, the mothership built out so that that's done and we can we can do some fun stuff with it. All right, so the first thing that I wanted to do was clear this out so that we can get the uh, mothership parked in here a little bit better. And then we can uh, we can work on, uh, as I get in here and over here, uh, the reason why I want to do this is because, oh, that's, oh, oh it's going to be so hard to park this thing. You know what? I may need an actual camera to park this. Never mind. By sure luck, I got it. So, with this locked, I mean, obviously, this is going to go deeper into the, the pit. I just have to redo the drills now to go deeper into the mountain so that we can get the rest of this in because it's still sticking out quite a ways. And I would assume that... Uh, now that I've taken away some of the power that I need to come in and put some reactors on it. I don't actually know. The, uh, let me see what the shield's like, because I think what I'm definitely going to do is the mothership is getting a shield now, because it is, it is just too uh, dangerous right now to have the mothership without a shield. So I think, unfortunately, it's... We may do have to do two different shields, or two shields on either side, but I'm going to work on uh, getting some of this done so that it, it looks nice. In fact, we can do two levels here. Yeah, there's, there's a lot I want to do with the mothership, but right now it's harbored a little bit better under the barn. I need to figure out a way to put, or to get this linked in as well. In fact, it has side. Yeah, it's got side mounted ones, so I may just pull this in a little bit underneath and drop it down. It's going to make it getting in and out of here a pain in the ass, but that's okay. This one is even harder to get lined up. Especially since I have no clue where I'm at, and these doors take so long to uh, open and close. Now, the thing that I can potentially do, which would be interesting, I just need to find it, antenna, broadcasting radius, we're going to go to like 100 meters. Oh, it was on. Oh, that's fun. Okay. Uh, so, we want to remote access uh, of target grid, however it's going Right, info. We powered it and have antenna. Oh, I may have to turn the antenna up a little bit. No. Action stable. Oh, it, it doesn't have a remote control. Or the remote control is not on. Let me uh, fix that. Well, now this is strange. I can control it from... Oh. It, no, that's... Oh, no, I can control it. Okay. I just have to figure out how I want to control this. There we go. And I don't have the thing on my hot bar. But that's okay. I've got it connected-ish. Um, I need to get out of... Yeah, there we go. Now, the one thing I do notice, I am pointing the wrong way. So I want to angle myself down once I sit in the, the seat here. And then I have to figure out which connector this is because I don't know which one it is. Um, that's also not... That's not the, the right connector. Of course it's not. Why would it be the right connector? Okay. All right. Somehow it locked. I don't know how. It's it's now in here. That's fine. We've just got to dig out the, the point for the mothership now. And I've got to get the rest of the stuff built on it. 
So that's what I'm going to work on now is getting the rest of the mothership built out. And potentially putting a shield of its own. That's if I spell shield right. Shield of its own on the mothership itself because it, it desperately needs it. And out of nowhere, stuff is exploding. What is going on? The PD seem to have, uh, oh, taken some interest off of me. They're not hostile with me anymore like they were last time. I just realized we kind of picked the, the short end of this asteroid here for the, the base. Mm -hmm. All right, you need to stop this, whatever you are. You are... Hello. Can you please stop that? Or not, or just just to kill me. That's fine. We're gonna have to have this conversation again as soon as I get my stuff. Which is right in your line of fire, which I'm not happy about. Give me this back. You need to stop now. Oh look, you You've crippled yourself here. Let me just take this. You don't need that. Those are your timers. Where is your... Where is your brain? gun is that that I don't know we're, we're gonna have to do some dismantling here you no longer have those thrusters what else can I take care of how about your battery no more battery you for some reason still have power you're, you're less noisy now. We're fine. Once again, explosions going off. What is it this time? Uh, I'm assuming it's the burst firebomb. I really don't care. They can blow up all they want. So what I've decided to do is that this is going to be split. We're going to have an upper level where I don't know what we're going to do. But it gives us at least a little bit of options. And then down here... We have, uh, we have some options to go for down here. Possibly. Alright, that one's going to have to stay, but we can pretty it up a little bit by doing that. Yeah, that works. So I'm, I'm going to get at least this side of the, the ship situated and probably expand it because... As we saw in the live stream, one good hit to like right here and the ship breaks in half, which is not something we want. So we've we've got to fix that somehow. This could very well be the dumbest thing I've ever attempted, but I'm going to attempt it. And if it doesn't work, then this will be interesting. Otherwise, I'm kind of curious if I can take over this Reaver because I think Chris would really enjoy having a ship this large in our arsenal. But, you know, I don't think it's going to work. I think I'm going to die immediately. I'm going to have to reload. But, you know, also possible that me, myself, am not going to be able to trigger this. Yeah, I don't think so. Ah, that's a shame. But if I take over this uh, strike ship and use that as the bait and just disable all the weapons that might work might work very well where's your where's your window Alright, now we've got to disable all the weapons. 
So you've got to come in here, turn off the turret, turn off the flechette launchers, Kraken turret, turn off, ants turrets, turn off, avalanche turn off, missile. Yeah, we're just going to turn all these off. This will be fun. Jeez, this thing has a lot of weapons. Huh. All right. Now, if we find that... And it could very well be that these have expired, which would be unfortunate, because I know one of them has... But we're just going to fly into this and see what happens. All right, let's see if this is big enough to uh, trigger the Reaver encounter. Fortunately, I think they're just both debunk. That's a shame. That's really a shame. Oh, well. Well, we've got this thing now. This really doesn't have much other than a metric ton of weapons. But if we got a second one, we could make our uh, uh, trident out of it again. We'll have to see. Worst case scenario, Chris is going to be really happy that he has a ship now that he can play with. Yeah. Chris should be enthused by this a lot. See, now that new dangerous encounter, I have a feeling, is a shielded ship. And I don't want to take that on by ourselves. We have... Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, remember how I, I said I was going to turn everything off? We're, we're going to turn it all back on. Please turn on. Let's Let's... Yep, let's go get this. This is going to be a battle. Everything go. Strafe a little bit. Please don't tell me all of my ammo is... Okay, I've got missiles. But not... Oh, well, Chris isn't going to have this for very long. Let's ram it! Ah, uh, my gyros! Ooh! Abandoning ship! This thing is... is brutal. That was brutal. I've ended up on the black ship for the, the hot piece of glass for some reason. Uh, where did those end up? I don't know. Unfortunately, it served its purpose and took out the... Uh, the re oh, nope, it's still... Something's still going on out there. They're still locked in an epic battle. I need to potentially try and take out the uh, the Reaver, though, because it's a Reaver. Ah, Chris would have been so happy. I may have to try and rebuild the... Oh! That thing is nasty. I just don't want it coming towards us, because... I don't want a repeat of what happened on the live stream. Now, in all reality, I could take the mothership out and just go after it, but that's that's not what I plan on doing. Oh, I had to cough. Ah, that was painful. You know, it's six kilometers away, and it should be far enough, but I also sent... The last one should have been following and going after the other ship I had sent after it, and it wasn't. So I'm going to be very cautious with this, if I can ever get close to it. I don't think I'm going to be able to very easily. Let's see, because it's going to start shooting at me. 
Yep. So I'm going to leave it be and continue working on the mothership. Well, the good news is I have this part of the ship uh, completely airtight now, and this is actually quite a decent space. Um, I don't know what we're going to put here, but it's it's a decent space, especially down here when you're you're on the mother ship. Um, we need to make some battle stations. I, I just thought of that. And even up here, this one's going to be a little bit tighter. Um, okay. It's a good thing I started recording because things seem to be going down. Um, let me off the ship. What is happening? I think we're going to have to go investigate. But I would assume that the mutilator has, in fact, rammed into the back of the mountain. What do you know? It rammed into the back of the mountain. Okay, let's kill its brain and be done with it. Nope. Brain. Die. Die, brain. Oh, it is bucking like crazy. No energy. Are you kidding me? Well, this is... Well, no kidding, my health is low. I'm gonna die from energy. This is crazy. Your health is critical. Yeah, I'm aware, computer lady. Can they steal it? I can't steal energy from that. It was worth a shot. I mean, it wasn't. I died. But. And now I'm in the barn. Oh. I think that is close enough that my. Some of the build and repairs are eating it. I can only hope. Let's go get my stuff. Out the little hole. Oh, I went completely the wrong way with. Uh, My body there. Which is unfortunate. No. Oh. Yeah. Let's see if that mutilator is still over here. Oh, nope. It's still over here, so we need to take over that real quick. That's a thing that needs to happen. Because this needs to stop. You are now mine, now stop. I don't know what it's done. All I'm going to do is paint this pink, and if something else wants to blow it up, have at it. Got a giant pink ship over there. There's pieces everywhere. I said that. Did it have warheads that just detonated? Let, let's make sure we, we don't have any de warheads. That's that's something I should probably uh, look for. Warheads. Okay. Possibly already. Is there anything decent in here? Uh, a decent amount of ammunition. Something tells me... Oh, okay. This is a lost cause, but for right now, this has a lot of uh, nuclear fuel on it, so I'm going to take as much as I can that's still connected. Um, okay, none of that's connected. Let's check other places. It's a conveyor. What a weird room. Um... That door doesn't want to open. Okay. I bet you all the reactors are busted, and that's why... Just want some of the uranium. Give me the uranium. 
Bye bye ship. That ship's going to forever be uh, lost to the the space. All right. Well, with all of this being worked on, or at least I should say worked on, I have at least half the mother ship here ready to go. Um, just bent everything into space. I'm going to have to redo this side because of what I did on the other side. I just wanted to, to kind of give a, this is what's going to happen. So the next time we stream, hopefully the mother ship is more complete and we can work on like the udder or something else uh, fun with this ship. Like I wouldn't mind having little fighters that this thing can house, but I don't know where we're going to put those outside of maybe docked under the tails back here. I don't know. We're going to figure it out. But until then, uh, this was D-Infinity X. I hope you have a good rest of your day.